guys <clears throat> I quit my job yeah I quit my job okay so update on the vision board I quit my job hey guys welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new my name is Corticia and today we are talking about our 2024 goals okay so it's exciting because literally I implemented doing these things in October I made a vision board in October and I kid you not <laughs> It's happening it's already happening for me and I really want to um, encourage people to just do the same do the same <laughs> because it works vision boards work manifest in your goals work prayers work but all of these things need to be actioned so you can not just sit by pray that you're gonna be a millionaire and do absolutely nothing to become a millionaire i created um two vision boards i created a 2024 2025 vision boards and i created a seasonal vision board and let's discuss my 2024 2025 vision board it's in front of me so anyway on that vision board i have um you know an extensive library because i want to read more i want to um, be in so we currently own a home our home is smaller we own a two bedroom one bath house love this house it's a townhouse um, we have two kiddos uh, a five-year-old and a two-year-old he just turned two. Oh my god okay literally his birthday was yesterday so anyway two two kids and we would I would love to be in a bigger space I me and my husband have goals of being in like a detached home of having the kids have their own rooms you know an office all of the things have like a family hangout room all of the things I truly love our home right now and I'm so appreciative of what I have and I really want to um I really want to romanticize this house even though this is not my dream home i feel like a lot of us get caught up in striving for the next thing and not appreciating what i have so i appreciate what they have so i really want to appreciate what we currently have going on right now so i i do love this house and i really want to continue to show appreciation to this house that being said up there is like my dream home <laughs> okay so vision board has my dream home on it um, we also have this girl with a rockin' body. I, I'm all about 2024 being like my health and wellness and just doing all of the things. And I don't want to really get caught up in like diet culture. I just really want to do it in um, a healthy way. And I really want to, I want to build it where. I don't bounce back from it i just want to live a consistently like healthy lifestyle and yeah that's her so there's like some delicious whole foods i've already started in implemented like i said um there's a girl up there with a graduation hat so like i said it's just 2024 but this is like 2024 2025 i would love to go back to school and get my um my bachelor's so um there's a group of women over here and i don't know if that is like a different corporate setting or if it's um you know me being an entrepreneur and me building like my own corporation either way i'm not opposed to like being a part of a corporation or um and just fixated on building my own company really am not i I can go both ways um there is my family i really want us to take more vacations in 2024 i want us to do more staycations i want us to just really love on each other and build i think we already have like a really great foundation um i just want to continue to build on that i don't want to i don't want to lose it i really want my kids to enjoy their childhood i really want to enjoy parenthood and obviously you never stop be being a parent but i just really want to um 
I feel like, you know, when they're little, this is the most these are the most important years and this is like forming so much of their brain and I just really want to try to be present. I really want to try to be the best parent version um, and I just want to do right by them. So I just really wanted to emphasize that. Um, there's a car on there. So we actually have a new car. We got our car last year, an SUV. Um, and <clears throat> my husband drives that car. It's my husband's, I mean, it's our family car. But I say my husband's car because I don't drive. I'm a passenger princess <laughs> and I want that to change. I want to, I need to drive. I need to get my own car. I need to, um, I need to get a license. I know I don't have a license. So literally that's why I'm saying our family car is his car because I, I just, I can't drive it. So that's going to change in 2024. Um, debt free. I have debt and we, we, we want to cut out, we want to cut out all of the debt. We want to get back on track. And there's a pregnant woman there. And honestly, I keep going back and forth. So I don't know. I don't know. Um, I know for sure if we, all of those, other, everything else have to be aligned in order for me to um, make an informed decision about having a third child. I know for sure a third is, is my cutoff point. I don't, I don't, we don't want any more. Well, my husband wants more, but I don't want any, I can't handle more than three. I want a third if everything else was good. I don't want to you know squeeze a third into this house and i also don't want to financially that's a lot i want to make a very responsible um informed decision so anyway that's how my dream board is looking for 2024 so like i said we need to action this out so i have um i made like an autumn vision board and so I think winter officially starts, did it start like five days ago? Yeah, I think it's December 24th, or December 23rd. I'm not 100% sure. I think we're now in winter, um, even though it feels like, when, it felt like winter. <laughs> if you're from Canada, it, it, already, it already feels like winter. So anyway, um, on this vision board, it has, you know, me taking, really embracing the, my, my health and going for more walks and i have been i fell off a little bit but i've been um going for more walks uh daily walks so you know happy about that i have my driver's license on a driver's license on here so my plan was to get my license by the time i filmed this video but i didn't do that so we're gonna push that into my next vision board that i'll be making for like winter i have that house <laughs> that living room set up because i really to me that's very organized and clean and i really want to be very organized with my home um i just want to make intentional purchases um i'm actually filming and all of my kids toys are here we got rid of a lot we we donated a whole lot before they got to open up like a couple of days before Christmas, um, so that's good. But I want to do more decluttering, and I've already started, so that's wonderful. I did the upstairs closet, and whew, it already feels like I'm like losing, I'm shedding pounds. Um, on here is, sorry, my foot is falling asleep. So on here, I also have um, like a chalet. I would love to do some sort of like winter getaway. We really wanted to do something for um my son's birthday like do like a sh rent out a chalet but it just it just wasn't it wasn't giving it wasn't giving that this season <laughs> it's not it's not giving that um i also have you know applying for new jobs um wanting to change uh up my in, in my employment because so i'm currently a buyer i work i'm a buyer and i work full time i work from home and i just i'm not feeling fulfilled well we'll get we'll get get into that so anyway it says apply for new jobs 
Um, I also have up there a, like a very trendy looking girl. I really want to get better at looking more presentable, you know, wake up, doing my makeup, hair, anything that's going to make me feel more, more put together. I also have pay off debts and I have um, a multi a pregnancy multivitamin that you don't have to be pregnant to um, take so yeah I want to start taking prepping my body for you know if we do decide to um, get pregnant have a third I want to be ready so I want to start prepping my body um, so I haven't I haven't picked them up yet but I will I'll pick them up because it's not gonna do any harm they're good multivitamins um, pre post during all of that so um but let's just talk about the most exciting thing guys <clears throat> i quit my job yeah i quit my job okay so update <laughs> on the vision board i quit my job and my last day is on uh january 5th um put in my two weeks notice and it was scary it was so scary um I also I'm going back to school I'm going back to university I know who am I I don't know anyway so I'm going back to university I quit my job and I'm going back to university so honestly <laughs> I don't know how okay let's let me rewind so I made this vision board I honestly like I don't know how transparent I want to be because I'm very I don't want to ever do anything that's gonna like harm me in the future and I'm very keen on like being professional at all times anyway <clears throat> I came to the realization that I just wasn't making what I felt like I should be making at my place of employment and um it maybe i'll talk more about it not like detailed but like there was like a specific thing that occurred and um i just was like what am i doing <laughs> like what am i doing and i've always so i did go to university i finished like two years at university and um i did two years and i ended up so i was working i was living on my own when i was um going to university I was working full-time going to school full-time and it was incredibly difficult when I got into my second year my grades were suffering um, I just couldn't balance the two I had to at that time at the time I felt like I had to choose one or the one or the other and um, I I quit I quit school I dropped my classes um, I was also on like academic probation so I was so scared of like messing up um and so i just quit i quit <laughs> i quit and i continued working full time and when i tell you that was one of my biggest regrets i regretted it and um yeah i just i i was so it was a lot so anyway i i always had in the back of my mind that i you know I worked really hard to get into university and I just I was I felt I was always I always felt disappointed in um when I dropped out guys I am starting school so my last day of work is January 5th my first day of university is January 8th and when I tell you I am incredibly incredibly excited I'm so excited I'm doing sociology so I also got a planner and I am just super excited about I'm super excited about life I hope you are super excited about life too just know that coming from a 38 year old who is deciding to go back to school and finish her degree um, I hope I'm I'm I can be of inspiration to someone I just feel like life is 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 meant to be enjoyed Life is also short, so if there's something that you're on the fence about and you're you're waiting for this sign, let let this let this video video be your sign. 
go do it go and do what you feel like you are called to do and i wish you all the best of luck in it um anyway like subscribe and comment if you want to continue seeing more of my journey i wish you nothing but love and success for 2024 and yes i will see you in the new year guys bye